Welcome to the speed test and comparison between the Samsung Galaxy A71 and A70 Android 10. A70's Android 10 update just came out and we are about to take a look at how it improves this phone. Before we begin, please subscribe as I have been working really hard for these videos and the subscriber count is not going up. At the moment, these handsets are running on the latest firmware updates of the Android 10. Both phones are using the same settings, both phones are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. There is no SIM card in these phones. A71 is powered by Snapdragon 730 with a RAM of 8GB. A70 on the other hand is powered by Snapdragon 675 with a RAM of 6GB. The n to score of these phones is on your screen. A70 has gained 6000 more points on the n to after the Android 10 rollout. Starting off uh, the speed test by restarting these phones. Oh great, uh, the A70 sweetly wins the restart test. Fingerprint scanner seems the same on both sides. A70's fingerprint scanner has improved a lot over time. It's much better than it was previously. Let's launch the stock apps, phone, the A71 it is, messages, A70 it is, settings, it's a tie, scrolling seems the same on both sides, camera, A71 it is, Facebook, A71 it is once again, Twitter, and it's the A71 this time too. Instagram, it's the A71. Let me check the zoom in and out and the scrolling capabilities. It's the same on both phones. It has got more fluid on the A70 with the One UI 2 animations. Let me load a website in the Chrome browser. Okay, it was a tie. Both phones were same. YouTube. A71 it is. Viva video. I will edit a video and export it. A71 seems to be way ahead. A70 is taking its time. Snapseed. I will edit a picture this time. The A70 finally wins for an app. I will edit another picture but this time in the Lightroom application. Okay, the Galaxy A71 it is again. Time to launch the PUBG Mobile. This seems to be a tie. Call of Duty Mobile seems to be loading faster on the Samsung Galaxy A70. Hill Climb Racing 2. It's the A71. Candy Crush Saga is faster on the A71 too. 
Subway surfers is faster on the A71 again. Temple Run 2 was also faster on the Samsung Galaxy A71. Okay, so all the apps are apparently still there in the realm of these phones. I will reload the apps randomly to see which ones load from the same place and which ones completely reload. Both phones did a pretty great job with this. The A70 reloaded just a couple of applications other than that. It went head to head with the Samsung Galaxy A71. I must say that the A70 did not disappoint at all with the new Android 10 update. Let me tell you what other differences are here. The A71 has the edge screen and the edge lighting features other than this software difference. The One UI 2 and the Android 10 on both the phones are completely same. A70 has the hardware limitations and of course, the A71 has an updated and much better hardware including a better CPU, a RAM, a better camera and the overall looks and ergonomics. But as far as the performance and the software is concerned, there isn't a huge difference. A71's chin and bezels are extremely thin whereas the A70's are slightly thicker. I have done a number of videos about the A71 and the A70 on my channel already. You can take a look at those videos, links are in the description and learn more about these handsets. Let me know what do you think about the Galaxy A70, especially after the new Android 10 Samsung One UI 2 update. Make sure to drop your feedback in the comments below. Do hit the subscribe button and the like button too. With that said, I will sign off. See you in the next one.